Good evening, my dudes. This is SPO Gamer for 60, even though you're probably not watching this at night, but still. I just say that just to tell what time I'm doing this at. Like, I'm doing it around nighttime. Actually, in the middle of the night. Literally midnight, I'm doing this. I'm, this like It's like 3.29 right now in the morning. And I know that I said I do basically the way the story mode boards. Well, these other. I mean, other than. Like basically the way this, like the order of the second board to the fifth board, in story mode, I, I said I was gonna do it that way backwards. But eventually, I have a change of plans. Um, uh, for Crystal Cliffs, like obviously you know Wufa, the character I played as in the first board. Um, Crystal Cliffs is his home board, and I feel like, you know, I feel like that would be a better idea for, you know. For, um, yeah, for the, for the other, yeah, yeah, for the other board playthrough, and I am Roger again, so yeah, just saying, okay, yeah, I felt like that was gonna be a little bit better, and I feel like, yeah, I was, yeah, before I started this video, I got a little bit confused, and I felt like, you know what, I'll just do it this way, could've been way worse, because I want the main character of the board to actually, you know, actually appear on it. I mean, I know that Pac-Man didn't appear on Green Grove, even though it's not really his board, you know, it's just kind of a, it's kind of a seaside, you know, yeah, kind of a seaside hill type of board, whatever, something, something like that. Alright, so let's get to this board, obviously it's the same as the other ones, only the positions of the spaces, and then later on, the boss battle. Wait a minute, what? Oh, I thought everybody was gonna get an 8. Pinky didn't, she got a 2. She got a 4th of what the rest of us got. Alright. And then the, the event for this board, we are not ringing up frogs. We are not stealing je uh, jelly beans from Ted. We are carving pumpkins. I mean, a pumpkin. Rather. Yeah. Hold on a second. Okay. Um, yeah. Yeah, we are forming a pumpkin for this board. Yeah, I bet it will be the scariest jack o' lantern ever. I don't really like Clyde's line, even though it does make sense, but like, yeah, what he says is, this will make one huge pumpkin pie, even though it kind of makes sense, but, yeah. and fuck you, Patra, and no, this is not Patra's board, you do not fight her here at story mode, basically in story mode, you know, I'll just say it now, um, in story mode for the boards, you start out at Rima Grove fighting Blinky, and then you go to Mirage Oasis, and then you fight Patra. Screw you, Patra. I hate your face and your sounds, and... God, I hate you so much. Anyways, uh, yeah. And yeah, then, yeah, in story mode, yeah. Once you get to Mirage Oasis after Cream of Grove, then you fight Patra. Like, like, you fight Patra at Mirage Oasis along with a couple of the ghosts. And then you fight... Um, you fight... You fight a couple, yeah, you fight a couple of the ghosts, and then, well, not, well, yeah, basically, you fight three of the ghosts. You fight Blinky, Inky, and then Clyde. You know, I mean, normally, like, Clyde is the main one you're going against, kind of like Patra at Mirage Oasis, Wufa at Crystal Cliffs, and Roger at Celebration Avenue. But, like, yeah, Crystal Cliffs, you fight a couple of the ghosts and Wufa, and Wufa is your main enemy, and then same thing as Celebration Avenue, both Roger. And it's pretty interesting, because in the story mode, well, not pretty interesting, but one thing's for sure about the story mode is that 
every board, except for Crystal Cliffs, has Blinky. I mean, something you is all, you know, just being all, being such a scaredy puss about in the, in the cutscene. I mean, not really cutscene, but you know. Yeah, kind of a cutscene in a way. I mean, normally it's just one of those things where they're just, you know, talking to each other and just, you know, those word bubbles. Yeah. And it's like Woofa scared away Inky and Blinky. And, yeah. Shoot, I wasn't paying attention. What was... And one, two, three. Darn it! Eh, that's cool. I can take a movement event. I like movement events at times. You know what I find so weird? Like, oh, I didn't get... No, no, I did get the movement event. Uh, one thing I find interesting, in Slim Kirby's Pac-Man Party playthrough, like, he never even used a single movement event once. I mean, there was one time where he actually landed on one, but, you know, he didn't actually get the event. He, yeah, he kind of had this thing happen to him. Yeah, this is the kind of, yeah, that's the thing that happens there. Yeah, one thing I don't like about this board is that it's, I mean, yes, it's basically in that spot, so as long as you memorize that, then you're good. But, like, you know, it just gets annoying when... Yeah. But, damn it! Screw you, Patra! You don't need all these castles! You're in first, you don't need another castle. Screw your face! Screw your fucking face big time! Pinky, you're moving so slow. Maybe I can take that when I go around the board next time. I just can't. I'm just joking. Anyways. Um. What? Oh, there I go. There goes my crown and Inky's crown. Rip crown. It was good wearing you. Alright. Um. Sorry, I'm distracted by a game. Just a second. Yeah, I'm good. Um. Hold on. Okay, whatever. Sorry about that. Um. One, two, three, four. Five. Okay, I kind of want an eight. Yes! Eight! I actually did time that, to be honest. I mean, that's one thing I like about the slot machine. Like, once you get used to it, even though they all have a different, you know, they all have a different order of numbers for each player. But, like, yeah, once you get used to the one you're using, then, yeah, it seems pretty simple. Of course, probably the most luck based out of them all is probably the ball drop one. That one's my least favorite. I mean, I'd rather use that than a frickin' dice block, because, you know, you can at least make sure you don't get a number you don't want, you know. Like, you don't want a 1 because of a misfortune tent. Just make sure the 1s are gone. Drop it. There you go. Got the 1. And good for you, Inky. You got found your cookies. Although, that does put you out of Patra. Where'd she land, anyways? She landed on a free space. The one after the good event Inky landed on. Alright. I got a castle. I'll be getting that little free next turn. Well, I'll try to. Hopefully, I can get an easy mini game to win it on. Oh, and Pinky's on Patch Castle. Take it away from her, Pinky. Take it away. Take it fucking away. Patra doesn't need another. I mean, d doesn't need those castles. She's winning. She's winning already. Of course, that whole thing about the you know the ghost moving over. Obviously, I didn't go past the other spaces, so obviously, I didn't get cookies. Oh gosh, I hate this mini game. Oh, hold on a second, I gotta.
Alright, let's continue. I had to check my list really quick. My list of mini games. Yes. Okay, let's try winning this if we can, even though I really suck at this. I'm not I mean I don't suck at this mini game, it's just really intense, especially when you go you know, when you go later on. I don't know how the thing works, like you know, like how much speed, like how many seconds it takes to add speed to the frickin' gears underneath that conveyor belt. And I hate it when my phone tries to turn off on me. When, oh, great! And is that the reason I lost? Wait a minute! Oh, 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 oh! oh! Well, at least Patra lost to Pinky. Congrats, Pinky, on winning, even though you're cornered by a couple of couches on a whatever that blue thing is. I'm guessing a fridge. It looks like one. But, yay, Pinky beat Patra. So I'm happy about that happening, because Patra is annoying, and we want to destroy her. And if she lands on the law free, she is a dead bitch. So yeah. Thank you, Pinky, for taking that away. I'd rather you have it. And besides, you're a ghost, and Patra's not. Yeah, that's the thing about the boards. Like, mostly, like... Like, Greenwood Grove, basically, is, you know, Pac-Man's, like, you know, beach and... I mean, yeah, part beach and part land. You know, type of area... I mean, not type, yeah, but, yeah, but, yeah, but okay, we're not for that, like, yeah, it's like, it's kind of, yeah, yeah, it's kind of is, wh whatever, yeah, it's just kind of, you know, part of, yeah, it's, it's just, yeah, it's part of his pack land, I guess, uh, yeah, and then obviously this board right here are kind of meant for all four of the ghosts. Patra's board is obviously spooky hollow. Shoot! <laughs> oh, one more, one more. Then, oh, come on. At least I didn't land on the misfortune. I hate that Patra's getting the law free, and she probably would have won it anyways. So like it mattered, I guess. Uh, I really wanted that. But I guess that's okay. I can get it on the next go round. I mean, it's okay that I don't, but I again didn't get it. But it's not okay with me that Patra freaking gets it. I hope somebody else steals that from her. Maybe they can just juggle around for a little bit, and then I can steal it back before anyone, repeat anyone, gets any bonuses from it. Wait a minute. Hold on. What? Has it really been this long? Hold on. Wow. Time just feels like it's going very slow. It's like the fourth or fifth turn. Hold on, one, two, three, four. yeah, fourth turn. Wow, Pinky, you're really trying to pick up Patra's castles. You're replacing purple with pink. I actually kind of agree with that. Even though pink is more of a girl color, I think I actually like pink more. Purple's not really my third fair color anymore. I feel like my third fair color would be camouflage. Even though camouflage is like a design or whatever. But I think it probably also counts the color as well. You know. Yeah. I mean, obviously, my fair colors are green and blue. Those are my top two. I mean, obviously, blue used to be my fair color when I was, when I was a kid. You know. Not anymore, but still. I mean, obviously, it's still second closest. Not, that's not the reason, but it's just, you know, it's just it's because it's the closest to green. But. so good at this minigame. I really think this game itself should have had, like, high scores for the minigames. Like, that would have been cool if they had that. I mean, of course, at the same time, there is the thing with the power cookie, so that might ruin it. But at the same time, you know. I mean, this is still a great game. Yay, Pinky won the castle again. By one point! Wow! And yeah, I get a power cookie. Got Patra power cookie too, but that's fine. I bet you're just gonna waste it in mini games. She's not part of like an idiot. 
I don't even understand why CPUs do that. They use power cookies in mini games they're not important about. I mean, it makes sense for boss mini games because you know there's obviously no attacking or defending in boss mini games. You're just all fighting the boss battle like you do in Mario Party 9, which I've been thinking about doing Mario Party 9 sometime. I'm not sure, but you know, I've been thinking about. Well, I am actually going to redo Mario Party 7 because I wanted to, you know. I just, you know. I just wanted to have better videos or whatever, you know. Yeah, I just I thought I could I thought it could be a little bit better. To where you know, in a way, it actually needed it, not just you know a little bit better, like just a little better, like it, you know, it actually it actually needed to be a little better, you know. Crap! I don't know what to do. No, at least it wasn't a one or a three, but still, I really wish for a five. But I guess a six. I mean, a four works. Well, at least Patrick getting uh, is getting misfortunes. So I'm thankful for that. I am not thankful for Patra, but I am thankful for the things that beat her up. Pinky is one of them. Unless you freaking steal cookies from me. If you do, I'll kill you. Oh wait, no, Inky's in first place. Never mind. So she got shared the wealth to take cookies from first place. Then it would have been Inky she would have taken from. Oh, here's a funny joke. Here's a really funny joke. Pinky just got 500 cookies from the gods. The gods got angry and did not want to give away those cookies. They went back down to take them. And they mistaken Pinky. I mean, they mistaken Patra for Pinky. Because purple and pink are quite similar in a way. Kinda. So they decided to come back down and take the cookies back. But eventually, again, they were mistaken Patra for Pinky. You know. That's like mistaking, like... Yeah, it's like how... It's like how in video... I mean, not in video... It's like... It's like, it's like in Sonic Adventure 2 Battle when they mistake Shadow for Sonic. Oh, yay. We get the cannon minigame. I would use the power cookie, only it is just... Although I do see the way. Yeah, one thing you want to do in this mini game is before you start the mini game, like see where the you know, you know, see what cans you should go into. Once the turn is over, we're gonna stop the video. All he's gotta do is just not use the power cookie. That's all he's gotta do. Or not go there. Dang it! <coughs> oh, dang it! That's nah, only a low one. I can take it back on the next go around. Could've been worse. I could have lost it to Patra. God, why did you take her? There? Why did you take him there? And why are see, like what I was talking about earlier? Why do they use power cookies when they're, not, when they're not important about it? They use it like they have to when they obviously do not. It's useless. Dang it, Inky! Why'd you take it? Whatever. It was kind of my fault. I should have used the power cookie. It was only a low one, so like it mattered. Even though I didn't get the cookies from it. But still, I, yeah, it's fine. It's fine. Whatever. It's fine. If it's like really important, like a big castle I'm trying to take or a big castle I'm trying to defend, then yeah, it's worth it. Even though yes, I didn't get the cookies, but well. but hey, at least I have a challenge, so I'll make it interesting. I don't know. I want to get the good event, but I also want to, you know, whatever. Just get that perfect cookie bonus. We must retreat. We must retreat. Retreat. Oh, wait. Stop the video. 